When I approached the bank, I figured I had some money and that I could go in and tell them that I got this amount of money in the bank, which they would see I want to borrow X amount, and therefore that would have been easy going. But I remember in one case, carry all the documents and provide everything that they asked for, and then they tell me, well, go home and wait for a, a, a message from the board or whoever had to make the decision. And I waited, and that evening when they called, they said, you didn't qualify. And the thing is that not qualifying, they didn't even give you an explanation. If you are talking about encouraging and creating the environment for persons to be able to access financing with everything that are changing, and I know that the banks and everybody is changing the way they operate to accommodate certain people who are at a certain pay grade and a certain pay level. But for us, because we work in a system where we work seasonal, I think that something should be able to be drafted where we are, where we are able to be captured into the net, where we are able to pay back these loans. A lot of our vessel owners are getting um, difficulties in accessing loans unless they can put up collateral. Uh, so some people have put up, you know, land, houses as collateral to be able to get boat loans. The other view as well is that boats is high risk. I don't know how many boating accidents you hear about in Barbados, but every day at the roundabout, I see bed fender benders. Um, so these are, you know, issues that we really need to address about how people view risks at the sea. Um, thinking innovatively about maybe a pay-per-use vessel-type insurance going forward.